YouTube is Tracker Fiend here. I uh, just figured I'd get out and go out for a little day hike. I'm actually out here, and uh, I believe it's a uh, Tansas State Forest. And uh, you can see right here, I have my little bush box wood burning stove. Uh, my heavy cover canteen cup. And this is double chocolate chip muffin mix. And all you gotta do is just add water and mix it up in a little Ziploc bag. I have some aluminum foil, which I shaped into the form of a cup. I mentioned I actually do that a lot in my uh, bushcraft kit video. And I am planning on trying to bake some double chocolate chip muffins in this. And you see right there, I have a little bit of water in there. You do a little steam baking, another piece of aluminum foil, kind of create a nice little air pocket down in there. So we'll see how this works. Uh, I already got my uh, little wood burning stove piled up. Let me get that thing going. I'm going to stop this video, get this thing piled up, get it going, get the uh, cup on there, and hopefully uh, get this thing to work out. So uh, bear with me. All right, I'm back. You can see that I uh, have my little bush box stove burning right now. I'm going to get this thing going into some coals, and uh, hopefully... Uh, this is probably going to take about maybe 10-15 minutes or so to get this thing into a nice little bed of coals. And once I do get this into a bed of coals, I'll set my canteen cup on top of there. And uh, as you can see right there, I'm going to get all the, uh, the mixture in there. You have to ignore the lighter. I had to borrow it from my uh, wife because I was having a cigar. But... Uh, Went ahead and used the lighter to go ahead and get the fire going. I know it's not really bushcraft per se, but that's okay. I was just trying to get a real quick uh, little double chocolate chip muffin going on, and that was going to be it. So, nothing serious. And um, hopefully knock this out. It should take maybe about 20, 30 minutes or so to, before this is uh, ready to go. But uh, we'll see how it goes. Um, again, I'll, I'll stop this video, and uh, once I get everything put on here I'm gonna get this thing going and uh, hopefully in about 20 30 minutes or so I'll get back to you and got a little I don't know if you can see that guy or not crawling around but got a little daddy long leg crawling all over the place but anyway I'm going to go ahead and get this thing keep feeding this thing get this thing up to temp get some coals going and uh, set this thing on top So, we'll see. Hopefully this will work out. I've done it before, but I don't think I've ever done it on my bush box. But I don't I don't really want to be having a, a constant... I want to have a nice little stove and not have a uh, open fire out here. There's, there's just way too many pine needles all over the place. And the last thing I need to do is be starting a forest fire. So, try to be safe. I'm going to stop this real quick and get back to you.